everyone, welcome back to Beast Reviews. Today I'm super excited because I'm back with some more slime stuff and I have my little plastic cover theme that I always do. And I have a batch of white slime here, which I'm really excited to do with lots of stuff with um, special add-in stuff that I got for Christmas that I have not used yet, which I really would like to use. So, yep, and I also have some fun cookie cutters and molds that I'm going to use today. And I might do some, like, background music for some of these ones, or I might talk. I am not quite sure, but just be prepared for anything of that. I like this little bit of slime on my hands right now. Um, anyway, you guys, I'm really excited, and a bunch of stuff I'm using, beads, clay, um, coloring, so much, um, charms. So I'm really excited. Let's get started. Alrighty, guys, to assemble our thing, I just made two Daiso Clay Dolphins. I kind of used, I used this um, mold right here and made a Daiso Clay Dolphin, two, two of them actually. And I'm going for kind of an underwater, I'm going for dolphin theme. And I have this really pretty blue glitter and this kind of um, flaky glitter too that I'm going to add to our kind of, make it look kind of oceany. And I'm still here guys. I also... I'm going to have a charm, and I'll just show you it real quick. Here are all the charms that I have, but I'm going to, since this is a dolphin theme, I'm going to do a little charm. Are those, are those two dolphins? Yes, yeah, so there are two dolphins. And this one. Would you like an ocean theme, you guys? Let's do the ocean theme. Yeah, let's do the ocean theme. We have a little... Well, I'm gonna dump these out so we can sort here. We have a another little dolphin, starfish. Oh, it's so pretty! Like a little ocean bird. Definitely want to have that in our ocean theme. Um, octopus, and oh my gosh, this is so cute! A little rowboat. I thought when I saw this, it's absolutely adorable with the two oars. It's absolutely precious. So, you guys, here's what we're gonna be using, and we're gonna add this to our slime. Alrighty, guys. So here is our cup that we're using. And let me get some of our slime out. I already made bubbles. So this is really good slime. And so it's really easy to add to our container because it's perfectly activated. So it's really good about it. I might not fold it, fill this up all the way. But yeah, this is probably about how I'm going to fill it up. Just like that. Set our slime over. So we have our little thing of it. We need to take a little bit out of that. We want to do a couple. Actually, no. No, that's good. Okay, you guys. So, I'm going to add my first dolphin on the top of there. And then my second little dolphin, kind of like that. And then, let's add some of this. I'm really sparing with this. So this is really cool stuff. Just a little bit on my hand. And then kind of put it in. Oh my gosh, that looks so cool. Not do any more than that. Looks awesome. And then we're going to add some blue glitter. The unscrew this just like that. Okay. Is this blue? Or is this kind of purpley blue? It doesn't really matter. Sometimes the ocean's a little purpley, right? Wow, this is really packed full. Alrighty guys, that looks super awesome so far. You guys, I don't usually do this kind of stuff, so hang with me, because I'm not really fast at doing this. So, um, let's add our sea creatures in this. So, we have our little fish, octopus, and little bird here, over there, let's see. And... You know, I'm not going to add the verb because it's too much. And little starfish. And that's all I'm going to add to this. So here is what it looks like for right now. A little ocean slime. Alrighty guys, now it's time for the moment we've all been waiting for to mix it up. So I'm going to just take our charms out because I don't really want to have them while I mix it up. 
in there. They, they do not stick to the slime at all. They're very good charms, but I just don't want it in there. So, let's do this. Whoa. Whoa. Look at our Daiso clay. Yes, Daiso clay is what is this meant for. So, whoa. Alright you guys, I'm going to mix this up some more, I'll be right back. awesome slime here it is I love how much you can see the glitter like not a lot of glitter so you can see that well so this glitter is also whatever it is um, so really awesome I the charms I got cleaned very easily a little bit trickier with the smaller ones but it did work so yep super awesome I did not use any water or anything just pull, pluck, pluck them out and do that all right you guys we've got an awesome slime that I'm gonna put back there and just a reminder, here's all the charms we used. If you guys want to look for them sometime. I honestly have no idea what like set this is or anything, what's it called or anything. So can't give you much information, <laughs> sadly. But it was a super awesome fun one. The ocean one, it was so cool. So let's put that back in our charms. And I think I'm gonna start, I'm gonna do a unicorn and rainbow magic one. So definitely for just sake on front of it so let's get started alrighty guys it's time to do a unicorn one because I probably have enough probably have enough slime for like two more uh, jars so I have this awesome soft clay and it's amazing it's like you see how soft that looks it's it's really good so I'm going to basically roll this out I'm gonna show you guys how I did this side because I didn't show for the dolphins how I did it so I'm gonna show you this and this is actually a mold that you might recognize from a different video but I got it in a tic-tac toy uh, uh, set so thanks tic-tac toy for that because it's a really awesome little cookie cutter that we're gonna use for this basically I'm just kind of making this flat and then setting it down and then I'm just going to cut a unicorn in it and peel the outside. So, and we got an adorable little unicorn. So awesome. Love that. And you know what? I think it would be really cool too is if we did this and we kind of made it flat and whatnot. Uh, and then made it in the center here took that out and we got ourselves a little unicorn print I think that is super awesome I think I want to stick with that you can put that inside but I think I want to stick with that uh, we got two here too so I don't know what we're, what we're gonna do with that maybe smush it huh uh, but that is really cool and we'll talk about solar stuff Alrighty guys, I've got the stuff that I want. I have this adorable thing that I'd use, and then I put something to make it more visible, which I was really excited about how that turned out. And then I have these little stars, which I think are perfect for like little unicorns. And these pretty pink fishbowl beads. And I have my slime in this container. And then I want to show you guys all these awesome glitters. They're like these tiny mini glitters that I think we should choose one to use. For this, so I'm kind of just looking around at all of them. They're all so awesome. Which one do we want to use? There's hearts, stars, flowers, uh, just regular glitter, balls. I think we should use like a little bit of gold because unicorns always need, need that little bit of gold. So I 
like we should use that oh my god literally this is like so cute like how could you like like whoever thought of this is so adorable like that's really cute so to assemble this we are going to basically set our daiso clay this is really tr tricky to do this on top of our slime woo nice got that done and then I'm gonna add some stars stars I trust okay just a little bit on top of here makes a little bit fun oh my gosh that is so fun looking really awesome and then we're adding just a few fish oil beads because I don't want it to take up the whole uh thing so just gonna pour a little bit into my hand whoa and add a little bit of fish oil beads to the top of this this is gonna be so fun I'm really excited about this you guys I don't usually do this kind of stuff, but it's really fun. Okay, official beads are done. And they have a little bit of this tiny glitter. How do you get this out of done, I wonder? Okay, uh, I'll be right back. Alrighty, guys, uh, new plan because I could not get that gold one open, so I just have another one of these bigger ones that we're going to add. Oof, it's already coming off. Okay. Oof. Okay, you guys, watch it go. Oh my gosh, I had too much probably. Oopsie daisies. Okay. Oh my gosh, how fun is that? I gotta take a picture of that, you guys. I'll be right there. Alright, took a picture and it's time. Oh my gosh, that's so fun. Whoa. Wee hoo. All right, I'll be right back with this more mix. All right, you guys, so mix this in a little bit more. Looking pretty good. Um, I, oh, I'm hoping that the blue doesn't overpower it. It was very little blue. It was more like that peachy pink stuff but it's okay if it does it's a really fun slime right now i really like it and i am going to add a little more uh gold glitter i think and you guys you know what i realized we missed was the little unicorn charts let's add those on how fun that is so cute um and then i'll add a little more glitter because we could always use a little more glitter in life, right? Yep. Little circle around the unicorns. So awesome. look at this slime I call it rainbow slash ball pit slime I want, to, I want to just put it together because you'd have to sit through anywhere and be talking and just sort of putting it together so really excited about making this in it's gonna be super fun anyway this these little rainbow charms are really cute couldn't decide which one to have in there I decided to have this one even though this one kind of goes better I like, to have, I like this one better so anyway let's do this
guys, here they all are. We have the awesome confetti ball pit slime that I absolutely love. This one turned out so awesome. I love it so much. And then we have our unicorn magic slime. I don't know if it looks like a unicorn magic slime to me, but it's pretty cool. And then we have our under the sea slime. I absolutely love how these ones turned out. Um, this has been a really fun video to film. I'm glad that I got back to slime because I had been off of slime stuff for a while, but this has been super awesome to come back to. So you guys, if you liked it, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. It really helps me know that you enjoyed it. And subscribe down below so you can join the Beast Toy Reviews crew where we have new videos every Sunday. Alright you guys, bye for now and see you next time.